For this practice, we're really going to focus on this idea of times on top and divide on bottom. So I have 2 times 1 third. Well, really, the 2 is a multiplier. So we're going to have 2 times 1. And that's going to give us our two groups of 1. And then we're going to have the divide by 3 on bottom. So we end up with two groups of 1, which is 1 plus 1. So we're going to end up with 2 on top. And the divisor 3 is on bottom. So in the last part of this question asks us, is 2 times 1 third greater than 1? In this case, no. So again, this idea of times on top divide on bottom is very useful for us when we do these problems. So in this next page here, it says we're, when we divide a fraction, multiply by a fraction is to divide a fraction. So there, this example we've shown here is 4 divided by 2. Well, the 4 is a times and the 2 is a divide. So that's going to be equal to 4 over 2, okay, which is same as that's equal to 2. So 4 divided by 2 is saying same as saying 1 half of 4, which is going to be 4 on top, 2 on bottom, which again is going to be 2. So 4 times 1 half times on top, 4 divide on bottom, 2, and that gives us the answer of 2. So this times on top, divide on bottom. If we can organize where we put these parts, we can do our fractions much easier by just using this rule. So the examples they've given you, we, you need to do the rest of these, but the examples here, 9 divided by 20 is saying 9 over 20 divided by 3 is same as 9 over 20 times 1 over 3. And notice that divide by 3 just goes on to the bottom. And we end up with 9 times 1 times on top, 20 times 3 divide on bottom. Okay, and we end up with 9, this is same as 9 over 60, or we could say that this simplifies to 3 over 3 over 20. Okay, so I get 3 on top and 20 on the bottom. Okay, so that's where we get, this is where, oops, so I kind of mixed this up, sorry. This should be This goes here, and then we can simplify that fraction into 3 on top and 20 on the bottom when we divide by 3. So times on top divide on bottom. So if we're dividing by 3, we can just put that 3 in the denominator, and that gives us the same answer.